So, uh, to the camera. Yep. Well, right. whatever you want. Okay. Hi, I'm Petri uh, uh, from Finland. Actually, uh, but I have time here in Sweden as well, and, and, and I'm, I'm taking care of business uh, uh, for Google here in these two countries. Okay. Um, Patrick, um, what are you doing on the internet right now? Meaning, on a personal level, what kind of applications do you use? Um, that's a good question. I think uh, my, my passion is very much uh, digital entertainment in many ways, and, and that's kind of my background also, kind of uh, from coming from television, etc., etc. So, uh, so uh, I would say that, that uh, I'm a, I'm a well, big consumer of, of YouTube, obviously, and, but also social medias are, are really growing up as well. But obviously, you know, it's like probably the most one uses is, is uh, uh, instant messaging and, and email because that's that's obviously related to the to the to the work we're doing. And um, if you were dead, what would remain of you on the internet? Uh, interesting question. I think there, there. Are, um my, my past is I used to be a professional uh, ice skater, so there's quite a lot of uh, video clips of, of, of me and my wife uh, skating around. So, so I think, uh, and I'm very proud of those. So at, at, at least those clips on YouTube would probably remain and stay there. So, so that's a, a wonderful way to kind of let one's art uh, pass and, 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 and continue. Do you want to be erased or kept alive on the internet? I think you know, it is that a quest for, for, for all human beings to, to become immortal and, and so in, in that sense uh, I'm absolutely not erasing my, my, the, the stuff I've done so, so I hope I, I, I could leave this, this world as a better, better place and, and, and leave that stuff that, that I've done and, and what we've done uh, for, for uh, uh, generations to come. Do you think that you should leave, you should leave instructions for your loved ones to be able to keep you alive on the internet and how you want that? Mm, no, no. I, th I think, uh, uh, as, as even if I'm like a businessman right now, but kind of coming, coming, uh, having been an artist for such a long time, I think it's more a question of kind of like uh, uh, letting people judge and and, and uh, interpret the, 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 the arts I've, I've done. So, so uh, uh, no, definitely not. And um, if you're dead. Should there be a marker to your name on the internet, like a dead or alive sign? No, no, I don't think that's that has anything to do with that. I think it's uh, you know, it's like uh, life goes on. Beautiful, thank you. And listen, uh, last question. Um, let's say we're both dead. Do you think that in the future or now we are still able to communicate with one another? Hmm. That's very. I think the question is: is how do you define being dead, uh, and and what does that mean, uh, and, and, and how, how does that relate to? Um, I have a, a very very dear grandmother who, who uh, more or less, I think, if she would have lived uh, in the Middle Ages, she'd probably be in a, a burn as, as 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 a witch. And uh, for example, she has a very. It's 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 not even you know, you know it sounds sounds very weird but but uh, on, I think at least that she has a very strong feeling towards kind of something like they would say I'm Star Wars and the other side and and I think that's kind of like we we don't know what's out there. Thank you very much for the interview.